Right, so basically everything. Yeah, I'm acting a bit of tech support here in the chat. Basically, there is a bug that sometimes go around that uh, if you load into the if you start the game you can sometimes see everything like you just bought the game or something like that you know with all the club things and all that and of course these fucking tutorial messages messages still on if that happens try opening ghost war and then returning uh because that usually works and we'll give it to them right so the first thing we're gonna do is we're actually going to equip the hk416 which has been fixed thank god so, the first thing we're gonna do is change the barrel. We're gonna put on the short barrel. And this actually looks kinda nice. We're also going to change the magazine to the standard one, so it looks a bit more sensible. And, of course, we might as well change the parts and uh, have the... Hmm. There is no EOTech and Enhancer part. Oh, wait, there it is. So, this will be our gun for today, and our teammates will, uh, as always, be Thermite, Pulse, and Ash. So, now we need to find some place to be. We've just killed Madre Coca, so I'm not going into Media Luna. I just want to uh, say that straight away. We're not going into Media Luna just yet, because I am not fucking suicidal. Uh, however, Esperusanto is not the worst place to be. Uh, it's actually quite an interesting storyline, and it's close enough. So I'm actually inclined to just pu uh, put a marker for Esperusanto. We'll grab a car and head right over. Esperusanto is also one of the main jungle regions, so while our clothing will stick out like a sore thumb, I'm kind of hoping that Caveras expertise from uh, the boat will be of use. Of course, um, what Cavera mostly did was uh, do battle in the favelas of Rio de Janeiro, so I'm not really sure she has ever been in a jungle, uh, aside from the urban one, so... Oh, come on. Me and driving. I just want to say that straight away. Me and fucking driving. Uh, I'm not a good driver by any stretch of the imagination, but let's head into Espiro de Santo and keep hitting the influence operation. Because the influence operations ha have already been unraveled by our... Uh, by assisting narco blogger Ramon Feliz, and by shutting up DJ Perico, or not really shutting him up, but making sure that he's news broadcasts are a bit more balanced by having a healthy dose of Radio Free Bolivia in it. Uh, there's a helicopter there, actually. We should grab that. Grabbing that helicopter should hopefully not be too difficult. Everyone out. We got one Tango. Tango down. Let's switch the... Magnifier on. Jump the fence. And thank you for the helicopter, dear Santa Blanca. I got it. I'll fly. Spot you. Back up. We got a sniper. Get down. We need to go. I don't really care about the rest of them. But we need to go. So, we're heading for Espor Santo, which is this way. And yes, the Cavera, Twitch, and Valkyrie mission is uh, available. It has been available for about a week now, so all you have to do is play it. And it's a pretty fun mission too. Uh, it could have been, it could have used more work. It uh, could most have certainly have used uh, more references to the old Rainbow Six team. But I understand why they p picked. Uh, these particular operators for the task, and at the uh, at the end of it, it just fits. They did they did their job well with that pack. Uh, I highly recommend people playing through the Rainbow Six mission. And at some point, we are gonna play through the Rainbow Six mission in Ghost mode. We're not just gonna do it right now. 
Right now we are in the Santo and we are gonna have some fun. We're entering a province called the Espiritu Santo. Espiritu Santo is the base for Sueño's religious propaganda. Key to that is a woman named La Santera, a self-proclaimed Santa Muerta priestess with thousands of loyal followers. That witch has an uncanny ability to turn men with guns into fanatics. That's the shit that keeps me up at night. Narcos have been into Santa Muerte for decades, but most worshippers aren't cartel. That's a small mercy. You got an angle on changing the mind of a fanatic? You're gonna need to dig for intel. Find out how to take down La Santera in a way that will demoralize the Sicarios and turn the regular folk away from the cartel. When she loses her congregation, bring that witch to me. Bowman out. La Santera, the saint maker. Es una chica loca. This chick is batshit crazy. She used to be a good girl, devout Catholic, until she found Santa Muerte, the skinny lady, and went all in. If El Cardinal is the light, charitable side of Santa Muerte, La Santera is the dark hedonism. The cartel's twisted, fucked up version of the saint. El Sueño knows a chart topper when he sees one, so he put her on his label. Preach, mommy. What's good for Santa Muerte is good for Santa Blanca. He even built her a sanctuary deep in the heart of Espiritu Santo. La Santera's role in the cartel? Ensure loyalty. The more cartel members prove themselves, the more access they get to Santa Muerte. You want Santa Muerte to protect you from bullets? Smuggle 200 kilos. You want to be blessed with eternal wealth? Recruit five of your cousins to Santa Blanca. You want to go to heaven? Kill ten of her enemies. It's like a ranking system for scumbags. The more you do for your cartel, the more the saint of holy death will do for you. A true reward for true believers. And trust me on this. La Santera is a true believer. Well, she seems like a reasonable woman. So let's see what skills we have available. Uh, drone one. Actually, drone armor seems like a nice thing to have. So let's... Oh, there's actually major intel in the nearby town. We'll head right over there with our new HK4716. And it's short barrel, meaning it will be about an inch or so easier to maneuver in these tight city alleys. There might be some intel around here. That there might. So let's head for the intel first, actually. There's intel at the end of the street. Most likely someone to talk to or something to photograph. Grabbing intel. Yeah, this guy. Hola, amigo. You hear anything about the cartel around here? Where they are, or things like that? Gracias. We'll leave a marker so the rebels can pick up these supplies later. Alright, so 200 meters to the nearest intel. We can do this. Enemy activity nearby. Copies all. There's another uh, intelligence uh, source straight ahead. Uh, however, there's also a bunch of armed fanatics straight ahead. So, ah, crap. Why did you have to shoot? And I'm not talking about Cavera, I'm talking about the guy with the Uzis. Let's grab the intel while we can. Okay, so we got seven weapon and accessory locations around the map here. He's not even wearing any armor, and for some reason I needed a, that amount of bullets to take him out. That's just ridiculous. Down you go. Hi to your friends. Got a map that marks the location of some kind of makeshift barracks in the jungle. Looks like La Santera's detail of Sicarios is living there. Grenade. We need to get out of here now. Get down. There's a helicopter right over there. We'll take cover, repel the enemy, and grab the copter.
Tango down. Keep it up. Everyone aboard. Actually, let's have a look on uh, the weapon cases. The Mark 48. Folded buttstock. For s the folded buttstock should already be unlocked for us. Same thing with that folded buttstock. That's weird. I'm on. Yeah, let's go. La Santera keeps her people in line with a personal force of Sicario bodyguards. Take them out, and we make her look weak in front of El Sueño and her followers. With pleasure. That makeshift barracks. Those boys look kind of salty. I expect La Santera's personal Sicarios are some of Santa Blanca's best. And there's a whole lot of them. Who's feeling froggy? All we have to do is basically blow them up with an attack helicopter. Come out, come out, wherever you are. An airborne assault? Never heard anything. Oh, there's a guy actually escaping from the camp. We can't have that. And the Murte will punish you for escaping like a fucking coward. Fire, fire, fire. Ah, crap. You need that. Come on, you need that. Can't you just leave us alone? We're trying to kill Santa Blanca for you here. Alright, next camp is two clicks away, and we are moving there at best possible speed. Roman, we just traded gunshots with a bunch of thick skinned Sicarios here in Espiritu Santo. Don't let your weapons cool down. I'm uploading coordinates for another Santa Blanca camp nearby. This place looks old school. The Jesuits came here to convert the indigenous tribes. Now Santa Blanca converted it into a Santa Muerte sanctuary. Ending this speech in front of all these followers could gain us some yardage against La Santera. Hello, Santa Blanca! Do you like being uh, w woken up like this in the morning by an attack helicopter with miniguns? Apparently, we managed to do this so well, the rest of the Sicarios are still inside. Oh, there's one. Opening fire, it's on the run. Put down some fire on these fuckers. And down they go. Two left in the houses. Let's see if we can't just stoop to this level. Tango down. We got him. Nice job, people. Elite Sicarios have been destroyed. That's it. the last man. I guess surrender isn't in their vocabulary. All right, so we already know there's an advisor here. Let's do it. Esteban Ibarra is La Santera's advisor and the cartel's point of contact with the cult in Espiritu Santo. It's time Ibarra met Santa Muerte face to face. I'll let you arrange the introductions. Roger that. I find this storyline pretty hilarious considering... Yo, Sicario with a submachine ...considering Cavera's makeup. In a way, she and our opponent is awfully similar, and I mean, with Cavera's makeup, this questline really fits her. There's a jam ring, jam ring progress here as well. 
but only on one of the sides for some ungodly reason. Alright. Guards are light. Let's see what we can do to light them up. Fuck! I forgot the suppressor! God damn it. Two down. Storm the main building. Ah, crap. They're firing at me. Why would I forget the suppressor? 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 Also, why the fuck did I forget the suppressor? I mean, if I hadn't forgotten the suppressor, that would have gone amazing. Damn, also, they're close. still firing at me, so you could... Was it too much to ask for you guys to actually clear the area before you revive me? He's down. Target is down. Say again, target is down. Sweep and clear the main building. We rattled somebody's cage. Santera! Binaki! Santera! Cardenal? What do I hear about this Santeria rituals? About human sacrifice. Santera, you are going too far. Faye! You does not worry by half measures, Padre. If you truly venerate Santa Muerte, you will join us. This is not how one venerates Santa Muerte. You will stop these rituals. Or what? No one misses these people, Padre. No one misses them. Or the camp's standing down. We're good. We got him. Let's head back to the helicopter. Damn, I love this job. The camp is clear. Moving on. Good to go. We really should try and get more ammunition as well. Uh, apparently there's a folded buttstock over there, but like I said, we already should have it, so... I don't, I don't really know why it shows up on our senses. Uh, we also have major intel in uh, one of the main cities, so I think I'm gonna go for the city at this point. Usually outposts in cities are far easier to get to. Let's set her down in the pa paw camp. We searched this location for intel. Yep. Yo, cartel gunman. Near the container. I don't see many locals. Looks like the cartel's Santa Muerte cult kicked him out and then moved in. One tango straight up ahead. Tango down. Tag the supplies. Let's have a look where the bonus medals are. The cartel's awarding accommodation to some thug. This notes the location of the medal. The medal is actually not far off. Can go down. You're gonna get made. Hang back. I got one of those cartel medals here. Some Sicario is gonna miss this. Okay, so that was the quiet running medal. Can go down. Guns. Insertion complete. Got it. Yo, we got a cartel LT over by that stack of tires. Copy. I found the location of Santa Blanca's gold caches in Espiritu Santo. This looks like their main source of revenue. Maybe the Sapper Daddy needs to pay them a visit. Sapper Daddy needs to pay them a visit. Sapper Daddy pretty much means we're gonna blow him up. So where's that ammo box? There it is. Okay, so Sapper Daddy's gonna pay them a visit. We need to change the site. We'll just put on the Micro T1. And maybe even switch the full grip to a... Oh, this actually doesn't look too bad but we're not we're not gonna have a 
We're just gonna have a standard standard issue full grip for that. Uh, yeah, that's that should be it. Also refilling our ammunition caches and then we're grabbing the helicopter and go. Yeah. Lassenteros cult is financed with gold provided by El Sueño. Locate and destroy these gold caches, and let's see if we can shake El Sueño's faith in the cult. All right. We need to be quiet about this, and it's still daytime, so we'll put down the helicopter right up over here, and we might actually grab. I got eyes on some kind of mine. Looks cartel run. A gold mine's never a good thing for a cartel to have. Who well, are? Let's shut it down. There should be intel at the end of the runway, so we might actually try and grab Check the plane on our way out. Looks loaded and ready to go. Well, shit! If they left the keys in the ignition, the dumbasses deserve what they get. Let's take it. There are a lot of cartel here now. Got a target carrying submachine guns. We need to infiltrate the mine as quietly as possible. We can't risk alerting the other guys. Tango's down. That was fucking close. No, that was just the way we wanted it. Go thermal. And be very quiet about this. As quiet as humanly possible. Heads up, we got a turret. Yeah, I see it. He's Target down. Spotted. I got a Jenny here. Careful. Very careful. That's ten targets. He's down. We're good. We're good. Yeah, I f actually think we're gonna place two C4s here. Eyes on a cartel heavy machine gunner next to the container. See? Roger that. We we'll place the first C4 here. The second C4 here. Primed and in place. Once that is done, we go here and blow it. Ah, crap. Wounded at bird on patrol. Watch out. The middle cache was never destroyed. We need to move it now. Holy shit, the whole place is about to collapse. Let's get the hell out of here, now. Yeah, copies all. We're running, now. Sounds like fun. Where is it? Destroy the gold caches given by the cartel to run the cult in the Spiritu Santo. No doubt El Sueño's faith in the Santero will be challenged. Sounds like fun. Let's do it. Let's just watch out for the unit at bird. We don't want to attract any undue attention, do we?
searching this location for intel? No. Nope. Keep moving. Target is two clicks out, and hopefully we can hit it without the enemy being none the wiser. Hopefully the location is also less well defended. Let's set her down. Little bird, fly through my window. Let's go. All right, send up the drone. Let's have a look. That is one heavily armed mine entrance. Right, team, we gotta do this together. Say the word. Three, two, one. Engaging. That's one guy on alert. Crap, there a fifth guy up just appeared. And he spotted us. We need to prevent the guy from raising the alarm. Watch your step, these guys know something's up. He's down. Watch the cars. Taking fire from the camp entry. Trouble get down. Okay, so we basically took cover behind the explosives. I can't imagine that being good for anyone. Crap, there's someone up here. He's down. Contact by the camp entrance. He's down. Let's sweep the mine. Clear on my side. Yeah, this mine is far superior in design. Uh, let's do it like that, and that, and run like fuck! Ah, that didn't work. We better grab some ammo from here and grab some more explosives. The frag grenades was insufficient. Got the C4 primed. C4 is primed. Everyone out. We got a man down. Ah, crap. Weaver is down. That rumbling. Let's take off before we get buried alive. Go. Not good. No, don't be on your way into the collapsing cave to rescue Weaver. All gold cash is destroyed. Mission complete. Holy shit. You can say that again. Alright, let's head back to our helicopter. Looks like it's going well right now. Just need to grab that helicopter and find another piece of intel. There's another piece of intel here, 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 and here. Uh, I actually think that uh, the intel up here will be the best. Some of the intel down. Oh, there's actually intel here as well. Uh, actually, I think we're going to grab the intel here. So we then can grab the MK48. In case we need heavy machine guns. At some point. Let's just head up and board the, board the chopper. Let's run. All right, let's head off the ground. And towards that end. Oh, crap! We're hit! Everyone out. Looks like we're not taking the helicopter. Uh, we can either go to Guari and try and grab the helicopter that way. Or we can grab the combat vehicle from the edge of the mine and basically just force our way into the next intelligence area. Uh, I'm actually going to go for the combat vehicle. Alright, everyone on.
Ash is on the gun turrets. Nice. Target is two clicks away and counting. Well, my bad driving coupled with um, the rather heavy handed approach of a combat vehicle is not the best combination, I would add. Let's have a look at the road. Actually, if we just continue the road forward, we can grab the MK48, the first thing we do. So let's do that. Right now, my loadout is pretty... doesn't really have that many heavy machine guns. And I actually wish to remedy that. Let's just park the combat vehicle right here. Dismount. There's at least one tango at the Good beginning of the road. I got him. However, his his friend now seems to be. There was at least four tangos by that car. I miscalculated. Another tango in the tree line. Ah, crap. There was also a tango either very close to me or next to me. This is not good. This is actually quite horrible. Uh, guys, you have cleared the area this time, right? No, they have not. Crap, we got involved into a fight I have really had no intention of getting myself involved into. Grenade. He's down. Take cover. Alright, we're disengaging. Everyone back to the combat vehicle. Prepare to re-engage enemy. Loudly and proudly. Can I get a gunner, please? Fire. A copy. Target down. Grenade, move. Blow them up. Blow up everyone. They are shooting at us. Blow them up. They should not be shooting at us. Blow them up. Blow them up quicker. Alright, we're heading out. Grabbing the gun, then we are getting the hell out of here. Nice. We can't actually switch to it, but... Let's refill our ammunition while we're still here. Okay, let's grab this thing, tag the intel, and... Yeah, that intel is these easiest one to get to. Everyone in. I'm in. Let's go. Uh, Fermite, are you heading in or not? Oh crap, you need that patrol on alert. That means we go. I don't care about anything else right now. We go. There's no way we are gonna stay here and Trade shots with you, need that. At most, our combat vehicle can take out whatever unit that is pursuing us, but it is inherently unhealthy to just provoke the unit that patrols.
one of those legal coca farms. So like, can we get some legal coca here for the altitude? For the altitude, yeah. You are not having any coca. You know, first thing headquarters is going to do when we get back home is make us a taste of the cup. But the altitude, it's getting hard to breathe. Shut up. Okay, I can see a number of Sicarius just ahead. Let's. That's locked down. Why couldn't we just run over the guy? Stand still and be run over, goddammit. Get ready. Fire. Oh, copy. That's locked made. Down. Damn good for a barn. Back home, all we ever needed for a barn was a padlock. Barns back home must not have anything worth stealing. Not worth as much as a couple tons of coca, anyway. Uh, so basically the place we are about to invade is a Unidad outpost, and I had no idea about that. Never mind the fact that our vehicle is getting busted, so we're gonna evacuate it and proceed on foot. Got some hostile activity. So this place is an observation post at almost 2,000 meters. No wonders Holt was complaining about the altitude. Eyes on an Unidad grunt over by the mortar. And it doesn't seem to be that much of other ways in either, for that matter. So basically, I'm just wasting a lot of time trying to run past the entire area. Hopefully, the observation post is small and lightly defended, and not at all. Filled with horrible, murderous Unidad grunts. Let's have a look at that, shall we? The drone is up. Okay, so one in the, the tower, two in the tower. Looks like to be a very small base with a mortar, a couple of snipers. Sniper, top of the tower. <sighs> we can actually go grab the intel from the rear and hopefully get out without actually... I'm not going to say we don't have to kill anyone because we most likely will have to do just that, but damn, this is a nice view. But we might be able to do this in a way where we don't have to take out the entire camp. Uh, however, the guys in the towers most likely need to be have their life expectancy cut a bit short. Eyes on a group of soldiers, right by the container. Excellent. He's not turned our way. He's down. Ah, crap! They heard a shot. God damn it! Roger. Let me get in position. Ah, thank God, they, the, the main crack. the main the base did not camp. hear the shots. He's down. Alright, let's send out some guys to engage the mortar. Call the rebels for some indirect fire. Copy that. Shut out. Grenade, get to cover. Fucking hell. The alarm is gone. This is not good. Roger that. I'm fairly certain I jinxed this. The moment I said I hope we don't have to take out the entire camp, basically that was exactly what what we doomed ourselves to. So let us move into a position where... Ah, crap. Scheduled maintenance starting in... 
about five minutes. Uh, and we are running out of ammo. Let's grab that intel and go, people. If we're lucky, all that will happen with the scheduled maintenance is that uh, uh, online services will not be affected. Hopefully ghost mode will not be affected by this. But we'll see. Interesting. Got a document here mentioning La Santera's main chapel in Espiritu Santo. Let's go check it out. Yes, I think so. We should as well. Uh, actually, while we're here, we can pretty much try and tag every single piece of uh, software and supplies. The problem is that there are still a shit ton of uh, enemy forces still inbound. And I'm not kidding about that. Done, done, and done. Oh yeah, right, the helicopter's out of commission. Let's grab the last intel and go. Who wants to fuck with the cartel by hijacking a supply chopper and handing it to the rebels? That's a double win for us. Found an address for a rebel radio station SB took off the air. Let's get that thing back online. Okay, so the helicopter's out. There's a lot of you need out at the gate. All aboard. Now. We're going. Man, y'all never let me drive anymore. Just cause that one time? Load up. Only engage as necessary. Our main objective is to get out, not kill Unidad. Uh, let's set... Yeah, we need to go. As in, right the hell now. Careful with the cars here. Clean break. Wait, did... Yeah, I know we have a scheduled maintenance. But did... No, the tutorial message just did not reset. Uh, but we still need a helicopter and most likely a weapon reload as well. I'm just wondering why it's scheduled maintenance today. I mean, it's Monday, right? Not Tuesday. Alright, let's find a place to grab a helicopter, and from there we can move up to... We've got a location. We'll put the blue marker for the moment. Uh, let's see here. We haven't actually been in the La Verde, so we're gonna avoid that one. It's a policy of mine. So all we need now is a helicopter to drop us off near that church if there's... And preferably not get ourselves driven into the river. Getting ourselves into the river would be bad for our health. This town might have a helicopter, let's have a look. Yeah, there's actually a helicopter right there. Uh, let's grab the cartel medal and uh, then the helicopter.
We got the skill points. Nice. Can't go down. We're cool, we're cool. So now is the time to find out if this is going to disconnect us or not. But I'm counting on the fact that this game can be played offline uh, to actually keep us in the game, so to speak. Off the ground, let's turn off the lighting. About two clicks to waypoint one. Four, three, two, one. Yeah, so ongoing maintenance ending in. F oh, great. So the first maintenance countdown we got it have now been replaced by another one. At least we weren't disconnected. As long as we weren't disconnected, I'm fine with it. And the freezes you are observing basically have little to do with uh, have very little to do with uh, the online services. They are more connected to the fact that uh, sometimes not even an SSD drive is enough to actually run this game properly. Let's set her down. We've got a location on La Santera's main chapel. She might not be around, but rumor has it that El Sueño's personal Bible is kept there. If we can't grab La Santera, we'll take nearby. the next best thing. Okay, we need to be real quiet for this one. Shit, Sicario with a minigun. Stack of yeah, I see the guy. He should have heard us, but maybe he's too coked up for it. I got a Sicario with Your a minigun. We're still by the church. Me. Okay, we got se lots of tangos. Check the rooftop. Yeah, one right, sniper at the rooftop. Heavily armed. Targets right there. It is imperative we do not raise an alarm right here. We also have a heavily armed patrol right there. Also a patrol on the streets. Sniper out there. Also sniper. Also heavy gun. Alright, this is going to be tricky. Very tricky indeed. Uh, we've taken down one of the snipers. Uh, oh crap, I was Target spotted. hoping I would be able to take out multiple yeah, this is how we do it. Roger that. Let me find a good position. Shit, I gotta find a good position. Yeah, find the good positions for these guys. Roger, Roger. target acquired. Target marked. Once Red. you have them. Call the shot. Opening fire on these fuckers. Oh, come on. Ah, oh, shit, we've been spotted. Sniper's got us targeted. I want to kill that sniper. Roger. He's all through. yours. Alright, 
You target these two guys. I got it. Moving target to position. Target acquired. Target them. Prep to go. We're running low on ammo here. We need to do this. Say the word. I don't have. That's Good. Tango down. Good one. They're gonna be on top of us in another few seconds. What do we do? Let's go. Last mag. Where are you guys even firing? Let's stay, stay low, stay low, stay low. Yeah, we're just hunted now. We're not gonna grab the weapon. We're gonna see if there's a way in through the back. Ah, uh, there is. While Santera is supposed to be helping him write it. It's bugging me out. All this religion mixed in with the drug trafficking. But it's smart. Faith can give a person a lot of strength of will. And it can make him act batshit crazy just because it's Tuesday. Just find the damn thing. Tango down. We are running low here. Tango down. Let's grab the Bible and go. There it is. Let's take on. With pleasure. We don't have time to browse. Let's go. Good job, people. Stealing their Bible ought to piss off Los Terra and Sueño. Got him. They think we're gone. Must think we backed off. Suits me just fine. Let's take the car. Hang on, I'll drive. We got more tangos rolling up. Turn on the night vision and turn off the lights. Grab that helicopter, we're gonna need it. Covering fire. Let's fuck him up. We're heading out. Break contact. I say again, break contact. Congratulations. Thanks to you, La Santera's world has been fucked raw. Word is Sueño's most pissed about her losing his Bible, calling it a mortal sin. He's got her locked, and he's planning a public execution. So we're done here, correct? Negative. We've done a number on La Santera's credibility. Imagine how Sueño will look if you blow his big PR stunt. You want us to save La Santera? I want you to save La Santera. Bowman out. This one is going to be tricky. We'll need to find where the fuck she's being held first. Then we gotta sneak in and engage. Sueño's lost faith with La Santera and is planning to execute her. Let's get to her first and offer her a way out. <sighs> we'll advance through the woods in the back. And we'll do, try and do so with our helicopter. We just need to find a decent landing spot. Yeah, this, this looks like a good one. Now we're running low on ammunition for our 416 here, so we got hostiles in the area. Let's check the notifications. 
five minutes left. That works fine for me. There's a jammer here. Jamming God us. damn it. She's guarded by at least two big bastards. Oh, sorry, Enemy one spot. big bastard. Heavily That's armed. Another one on the stay. gun. To the guy on the gun is yours. Let me find a good Second position. guy on the gun is yours. Got the Drone's crapping out. They must be jamming it. Copy that. Moving. Got a third target. Enemy marked. Once you have him, we'll take the shot and go. Ready to fire. Good. Got Sweet. Let's see if we can't get. Ah, uh, crap. We can't get down that way. Cover me. I'm going to grab her. on target. Here she is. We did all this work to get her here. It seems a shame to rescue her. Yeah. Amen to that. Let me go, herejes mundo, or I shall call Santa Muerte's divine wrath upon you. Yeah, that doesn't the really work that way. With the blood of you and your family. That's fucking harsh, lady. Weapons free. Weapons free. Let's go. Their lieutenant's running away. Yeah, let their lieutenant run away. I swear to was gonna execute him Sniper, for this. Get the fuck down. If I was a, if I was the lieutenant, I would also run the fuck away if my prisoner just escaped right under my nose. They got an armed helicopter on the way. This is bad, people. Go. Hopefully, the armed helicopter is heading more towards the side of the battle rather than. You know, the site of... In fact... Uh, let's have one of these. A Nvidia Ansel moment of... Cavera and what's probably Cavera's mother at this point. I mean, it wouldn't really surprise me if that was the case. And let's have one with the night... Night vision filter on as well. Come on, we're getting you out of here. You are now being stowed into a helicopter. And we are getting the fuck out of here. Alright, check where do we need to take her. Alright, I see it. Exfiltration in progress. Good to go. San Diego. By the time you believe, by the time you understand, it will be too late for you. Whoa, this lake stinks. I guess all those trees. You believe that your guns give you power over death. But no one has power over Santa Muerte. And death shall have no dominion. Okay? idiota? Whoa, this lake stinks. I guess all those tree hug. You let me go! Estupido! Aquí ya soy el poder! I have power! they really tried to get that conversation going about environment and stuff like that but this crazy oh first she threatened us and now she's very very about us not killing her Bowman never saw her so let's just bring her into the jungle and put a bullet in his head her head sadly we can't do that Santissima Muerte is my rock my fortress my deliverer Wrap your wings around me, protect me from the storm, and bring your wrath upon my enemies. We've seen your wrath, Santera, and honestly, we're not impressed. I have done nothing wrong. Santa Muerte is my light and my way. Worshipping her is not against the law. 
No, but recruiting people into a criminal organization sure as fuck is. Judgment is reserved for God and Santissima Muerte. Maybe in the next life, but not here. You want to earn some absolution? What do you know about Sueño? I am no Judas. No te equivoques. I will never betray Brother Sueño. You know, people like you aren't treated very nicely in prison. Other inmates tend to make their life hell. I have the faith to survive in hell. Hmm. I look forward to testing that faith. Because you've never seen my hell. One less Patron is to worry about. And of course, this loading is going to take an age and a half. Nomad, well done in Espiritu Santo. Any word on how the Sicarios are reacting? With a lot of crying and cursing. From some of the chatter the activities picked up, the cartel's morale is the lowest it's ever been. Keep the hits coming. Bowman out. Sweet. <laughs> Forgive me, Padre, for I have sinned. Speak the secrets of your soul, my son. Padre, I have lost the love of the people. I thought it was enough that they feared me. I was wrong. Me equivoqué. To win, I needed their love. Why don't they love you, hijo? Because you have not made them love you. You must hold charity events. Gracias, Patron. Mother's Day and the Day of the Children. You must provide hospitals, schools, everything the people need. Es tu gente. Because the Bible He doesn't really us, look very happy about by it. By his work shall you know him. Don't go drinking around here. All her followers are feeling betrayed and vengeful. Good. I doubt their cult will recover from this. Alright, so I don't think we have any Bichonas missions. I'm actually gonna check that out. Uh, actually, we only have Malka left when it comes to influence. So... Let's have a look where Malka actually is. Yes, Malka is down here. It's actually quite an easy one, too. Or at least it's not the worst of them all. But we are we're actually progressing fairly well in this ghost mode. So I'm just gonna check how long we have. Yeah, we're actually on. Uh, no, we're not online yet. <sighs> but I actually think that Malka is going to be our next operation, really. Uh, Espiro Santo is clear. Villa Verde is production. Uh, Villa Ver production is also nice to hit, but uh, uh, if we do this, we can complete the influence arc. And if we complete the influence arc, we get a reward. We get uh, part of the power armor. So El Chido is the last guy, and then we have El Cardinal. And then if we just dismantle all the influence, we have that. Thankfully, we don't have to do uh, some of the DLC contents in order to 
dismantle security or I would be pissed because um, there are some parts of that that are just fucking horrible to do. Uh, however, I think that I will call it a day for now and um, I'm just going to see it. Yeah, we're actually back online. So there's one more thing we can do and that is we can go to the store. Where we have at least 400 prestige credits. In fact, I get the feeling we should have more, but let's go to the battle crates. And open up a prestige crate. We did not get an item we already had, at least. Sweet! We got the SR25 Liberator. For a prestige pack, that is actually quite a good item. I mean, it's not like I can actually complain about it. So, we are done, and thank you for tuning in. This has been really fun, and we have been managing to sweep and clear yet another region, and evading our eternal fate in Permadeath. So, catch you guys later, and thank you for tuning in.